so now let's see the calculations for power pack how we are doing so we have seen the operation of uh, hydraulic power pack you start the electric motor and hydraulic oil will be pumped through the hydraulic pump to the different pumps or parts of the ship wherever required for opening the hatch covers and all and now we will see the calculations so basically the calculation we are going to see is for calculating the pump and the motor size so if you see in this excel sheet we have different inputs and outputs of the pumps we have the cylindrical bore strokes and uh, for basically main thing we have to calculate is the flow rate and the lpm that is you can see here liters per minute so that is the capacity how we measure the pump uh, or motor size at how many liters per minute this motor requires so this is a hydraulic cylinder or this thing double acting single ended uh, cylinder you have the main body and uh, this is a bore diameter so you have these parts bore means the hole or where it, all this oil is going so all this size we have in the excel sheet fluid from the pump uh, that is called detraction so we have to apply the pressure on this pore area where you see these red arrows to get the oil sucked in inside so this is the sheet for our calculations of power so basically desired input is your cylinder stroke at what how much time it is traveling so our in cylinder stroke is in 1 second forward so it's going uh, 160 mm in 1 second and uh, radius is 125 so this is the volume of the cylinder which should be filled in 1 second because the stroke time is 1 second and when this uh, cylinder is going forward it will retract in less than 1 second because we have piston rod also part to so this piston rod part is also part is reduced to calculate the motor horse power first we need to calculate the lpm that's a liter per minute how many liters per minute our we have to input or the flow rate of the oil and then volume of the cylinder efficiency of the pump we take approximately 70% and the tank size should be four times the lpm or liters per minute that is the rule so flow rate or liters per minute we will calculate by first we will calculate the volume of the cylinder so cylindrical you know volume of the cylinder is pi r square h or we have the diameter here So pi by four d square into length or h. So we have all units in mm here. So we put in the formula. Diameter is one twenty five mm and length is one sixty mm. So pi by four one twenty five square one sixty. So we get the volume of the cylinder. So we got the volume as 1.963 and to calculate per minute this is for per second because it's for one stroke so per minutes so if you uh, take 1.963 as approximately 2 liters per second so multiply by 60 so approximately 120 liters per minute that is our flow rate so if you take in decimals 117 approximately 120 liters per minute that is our pump capacity or requirement 
then we calculate the horsepower so formula for horsepower is in kilowatts is q that is liters per minute so and p is your in pressure in bars so q is the discharge in liters per minute and p is pressure in bars divided by 60 into efficiency so efficiency will be dependent depending on pump and specification as per the manufacturer's catalog and after calculating and putting all the this thing kilowatt if we convert into horsepower we divide by 0.745 and you get the answer as 21.285 horsepower that is our horsepower and to calculate the capacity of the tank it should be four times lpm so four into 120 that is 480 liters should be the tank capacity <laughs>